good morning students today we are going to see the patterns of settlement the, in the previous lecture we have learned about the types of settlement and it is depend on the settlements the const, uh, the cluster of settlements now the pattern of settlements are they are based on the shape what kind of shape it looks on that basis the pattern is given in that the first pattern is now the first pattern is linear pattern now linear line the name itself gives you the idea that is line now this line straight line it can be a road it can be a river because most of the areas they are in the straight pattern so straight line the settlements are looking into straight line shape it means the houses the settlements are located on along the banks of the river or along the roads so that is called linear settlement so roads and rivers okay the second pattern is rectangular pattern the rectangular pattern is called when the two lines the two two straight lines are parallel to each other okay so for example if one road is going okay the settlements are located here okay parallel roads are also there and the settlements are located over there so this type is called rectangular pattern okay now the third type is patternless patternless the word itself gives you the idea that there is no pattern of any settlement the settlements are located wherever they are getting the places the houses are built as per the convenience of the space availability so there is no kind of pattern they, they can be the clustered they can be the con compact any how any roads any kind of small roads along the um, unwetted roads anywhere wherever the place is vacant and place is available the houses are constructed so that pattern is that is patternless pattern then the next is radial pattern now rad radial pattern is the pattern that the settlements are grow around a central object it means at a center some object some monument some facility is there which is a need of people around that the settlements are located so it can be a uh, temple or the uh, main mall any kind of any kind of uh, object around which the settlements are growing and that is called radial pattern the another pattern is circular pattern
Now, circular pattern itself gives us the idea that the settlements are in the circular shape. Why it is? It can so there can be in the middle there can be a lake, a well, any any object which is important. So. After that means when the um, uh, settlements are located, um, uh, we see uh, these uh, settlements in the circular shape. So that is called circular pattern. The next is triangular pattern. Now triangular pattern triangle triangle okay so in this the triangles are generally formed where the two rivers are meeting to each other so that point can be a confluence of river also the, the two roads are meeting one main major road and one secondary road which is meeting to the main road so on the banks along the banks of the rivers uh, along the um, the confluence of the river or uh, along the confluence of two main river uh, roads the settlements are located so it is creating a triangle shape and so the settlements which are formed which are located on along the banks of the river or along the uh, confluence of the river along the roads of the river this shape is called triangular pattern so these are the patterns on the basis of shape we observed after the uh, the settlements are located so first is linear pattern second is rectangular pattern third is patternless the fourth is radial pattern then the fifth is circular pattern and the sixth is triangular pattern now in all these six patterns you will see there is a shape and that shape is formed due to some objects some facilities which are needed for the survival and so these patterns are observed thank you